<laughs> okay, now we are going to continue with the uh, lectures. Um, at the beginning, we are going to talk about the uh, uh, lasing, uh, and we are going to derive necessary uh, mathematical formulas uh, for the light signals. Okay, uh, as we have mentioned before, uh, the Nyquist theorem, we have an important uh, points, we have to mention it. Then we are going to derive the necessary formulas for the uh, lasing. Uh, the sampling rate must be greater than the twice maximum frequency present in the input signal. Uh, in the previous lectures, we have solved uh, some mathematical problems. Uh, you have seen that when we have a signal which composed of more than uh, one sinusoidal signal, it means that what it means that this signal contains a set of frequencies, not a unique frequency. In such a cases, we are going to determine the maximum frequency, and after that, multiply the maximum frequency by two to get what to get the uh, the Nyquist rate. Of course, whenever we are going to sample any analog signal above or equal to Nyquist rate, at that time, the signal can be reconstructed successfully. Otherwise, the signal will not be recovered, and this case will be called overlapping and lasing. Overlapping or lasing. The critical sampling rate 2W, which is 2B, when we talk about baseband signals, of course. Now, the above statement is known as the Nyquist sampling theorem, and is definitely one of the most powerful concepts even ever seen by an engineering student. Now, analyzing, we have some definitions and then we are going to uh, switch to the whiteboard and to drive necessary uh, relationships. Well, now we have seen that a continuous time signal can be completely reconstructed from its samples. Of course, on condition that what, when we are going to sample the signal by sampling rate greater than or equal to Nyquist rate. 
This process will not be possible if the samples are spaced too far apart in time. As you know, time and frequency, time and frequency, frequency equals to one over time and time equals to one over frequency. So whenever we are talking about uh, uh, large space between the samples in time domain means what? means frequency is small, okay? Or in other words, uh, the sampling rate is too low, okay? So why? <laughs> as, the, as the impulses in the impulse train in the time are spaced farther and farther, the impulses in the transformers of F get closer and closer means what? Means reduction in the sampling frequency and this will lead to what leads to uh, process which is called a lazing or uh, over uh, or uh, spectrum overlapping now uh, this is the case we are talking about once the spectrum gets graveled like that it will be impossible to recover the original signal uh, the situation where spectral overlap occurs is known as a lazing look at uh, this figure okay now this is the uh, original uh, say signal but due to a bad selection of the sampling rate here we have another replica which which will leaks inside the what inside the interested band of the uh, desired signal so in this case even if you are going to use a low pass filter or any kind of filters it will be an impossible job to recover the original signal in the case of overlap, the high frequency information a lasers resembles looks like. Okay, as I think is very clear. What do you mean by a lasing? High frequency and low frequency signal will overlap. So okay, a lasers. This effect is demonstrated below with a high frequency sine wave. That is sampled too slow, even though the sine wave is sampled at regular interval. The reconstruction process fails to reproduce the original signal since the samples are spaced too far apart in time. Now let's go to the uh, figure and to show you what do you mean by uh, the lazing or ambiguity in the digital signals. As you can see here, we have small circles. These small circles or points represents what the sample values, the sample values. Now. Uh, these sample values, we have two sinusoidal signals. First sinusoidal signal, which is the low frequency. Look, look at the bold curve. The bold curve represents what represents low frequency signal. Now look at these points. We have, we have passed a low frequency sine wave through these points. You, you can see, okay? You can see that we have passed through these points a low frequency sinusoidal signal. Again, look, another sinusoidal signal is passed through the same points. Look, but in the the second uh, the second sinusoidal or unbold sinusoidal signal ha is, has higher frequency than the first one. Okay, again the higher frequency sine wave is passed through these points now my question is these points belongs to which sinusoidal signal to cosine omega 1t or to cosine omega 2t say omega 2 will be the high frequency and omega 1 will be the low frequency now can anyone answer this question now these points belongs to which sinusoidal signal Hmm? These points belongs to which sinusoidal signal? To the low frequency signal or to the high frequency signal? Can you decide? I think it's by low frequency signal. Really, really, we don't. I, I don't have the ability to determine these points belongs to which sinusoidal signal. Okay, this is the ambiguity or the confusion in the uh, lasing. Okay. Of course, we may pass through these points infinite number of sinusoidal signals, okay? So these points, okay, these points now has what? 
these points have more than one function, which, we, which can be used to describe the points, okay? So this is the lasing or the frequency overlapping as we say before. Now I'm going to drive uh, the, some mathematical relations uh, for the uh, lasing. Now let us uh, start with the uh, derivation. Okay, now I'm going to uh, derive uh, the formula for the uh, lasing. Uh, as I think everyone is familiar with the sinusoidal signals, uh, you see the, the whiteboard clearly. Huh? Do you see with the whiteboard? Yes, okay, now. Yes, teacher. Okay, now. Let us start with the sinusoidal signal. Of course, at the beginning, I'm going to talk about the sinusoidal signal. Then uh, we are going to extend the uh, relation. Well, assume that we have a sine signal, x of t. x of t equals to sine 2 pi f naught t. It's very clear that this signal has a frequency f naught, and it has unique frequency f naught, no more, no less. Well, now, first of all, I am going to convert uh, this signal into discrete time signal. As you know, x of n and x of t, the relation between x of n, t, s, and x of t will be x of t, equals to x of x of n t s sorry equals to x of t when each t is replaced by n t s okay when each, each t is replaced by what by n t s well so how we are going to determine x of n t s for this sine wave is it will be as follows look x of n t s of course look at uh, square brackets for what for discrete time uh, uh, signal and round brackets is are used for what for the analog signal now x of nts will be sine 2 pi f naught n ts now this will be the discrete time signal now how we are going to determine the samples for such a signal of course we have uh, we are going to talk about uh, this signal. This will be the sign signal. We may have a sample here. Okay. This is the samples taken by the sampler. Well, we are going to sample the signal. Well, now, what will be the next step? Now, I'm going to talk about these. For example, determine x of zero. Okay determine x of zero, it means that sine to pi f naught zero ts. Of course, it will be sine of zero and it will be zero. Now, then we have say x of one, it will be sine to pi f naught one by ts x of 2 it will be sine 2 pi f naught 
two ts and so on okay up to x of n which is sine 2 pi f naught n ts this is the what this is the general formula for the what for discrete uh, time signal okay discrete time signal now by now we have what some assumptions to mention look please say we have this sinusoidal signal Now, I'm going to select a point, for example, this point. Of course, at this point, say the value is about, uh, for example, say 0 0.8, 0 0.7, something well, roughly, say it's 0 0.8. Now, after 2 pi, okay, after 2 pi, we have the same value, okay? We have the same value, of course. After 4 pi, again, we have what? We have, again, the same value. So, sine, sine 2 pi f naught t, okay, will equals to what? Will equals to sine 2 pi f naught t plus m 2 pi, okay? After adding integer number of 2 pi, you can get what? The same value. So adding m 2 pi periods to the sinusoidal signal will give you what? The same value. Now, so by now we are going to go to the, go back to the original signal. Now, here we have x of n, which is sine, 2 pi f naught t f naught t and uh, after uh, sampling it becomes it becomes n t s now i'm going to add complete cycles to this sine wave what will happen look sine 2 pi f naught n t s a plus m multiplied by 2 pi okay a plus m 2 pi now what we are going to do now let us take let us take n t s as a common factor okay let let us take n t s as a common factor and look what's going on it will be sine 2 pi 2 pi again can be taken as a as, as a as a common factor it will be f not a plus m over n ts multiplied by n ts okay this will be uh, the same signal look x of n equals to sine 2 pi f naught n ts and equals to what equals to sine 2 pi f naught plus m over n ts multiplied by n ts now we have the same signal well Continue. Now, what we are going to do now? Let let m equals to k by n. Okay. Let m equal to k n, and k is an integer number. Okay. Keep in your mind that k will be integer number. Well, now what will happen? Of course, m over n will be will be k. Okay, so equals sine two pi f naught plus k 
k over ts multiplied by n ts as you know fs will be 1 over ts so the equation will be modified and becomes sine 2 pi f naught plus k fs n ts okay now this will be uh, the final uh, equation now this equation really will help us to uh, to determine the lasing of a signal now what we can conclude look at we said that x of n equals 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 uh, up to getting what up to getting this relation i mean this relation equals to what x of n and what was x of n x of n was sine 2 pi f naught n t s equals to what equals to sine 2 pi f naught plus k f s n t s okay now is it acceptable or not yes it's acceptable what does it mean it means that f naught will be looks like what f naught plus k f s okay k f s so in this way we can what we can determine uh, the lasing uh, for the signals now this is the imp very important relation to determine in some textbooks are called allied frequency in other textbooks are called apparent frequency okay all of these names are for what for the allies the frequency or for the apparent frequency the same meaning we have well now let us utilize this formula now f a lazing f a will be what will be f not plus what plus k f s now which component of the lazing will affect the system performance Many times I have told you when we are going to reconstruct a signal, this is an important thing. To reconstruct any signal, we need what? We need a low pass filter. The low pass filter cutoff frequency will be what? Will be Fs over 2 or the sampling rate of the system over 2. Now, signal reconstruction, okay, to reconstruct, to reconstruct the sampled or the original signal what we are going to do we are going to use a low pass filter a low pass filter with cutoff frequency fc fc equals to sampling rate over two okay sampling rate over two now due to the lazing and this confusion okay now we said that we have a low pass filter you are you are going to what you are going to calculate the allied components okay the allied components are overlapped which lies where inside the low pass box well so this will be fc and this is minus fc this will be the interested region well so we are going to look for the what to look for the signals which lie where which lie inside this box of course to illustrate uh, this relationship and uh, the lazing process now we have two examples at the beginning i'm going to talk about example number one and then uh, we have example number two. Now let us talk about the example number one. Example one. Show that, show that samples, show that samples of 90 hertz, 90 hertz, and 110 hertz of the form 
of the form cosine omega not t are identical are identical are identical when sampled at rate of 200 hertz okay now let us discuss the information in this question and then we are going to uh, talk in detail about the relation now show that the samples of the 90 and 110 hertz uh, really we by now we have what we have two sinusoidal signals okay or two cosine signals two cosine signals uh, these two cosine signals i mean cosine 2 pi 90 t and another cosine signal which is cosine 2 pi 110 t these are the two cosine signal which are talking we are talking about well now at the beginning we have talked about uh, the many times i have told you that correct sampling rate will be what when we are sampled the signal by sampling rate greater than or equal to 2f maximum or 2b <coughs> now the sampling rate in this uh, uh, example is determined by 200 hertz now if you are going to sample the first signal by 200 hertz is it okay or not is it a, a, an acceptable sampling rate for the first cosine signal or it's unacceptable hmm? yes it's acceptable why is acceptable it's acceptable uh, as long as acceptable but Bucci. because so it's less data. It's, it must be greater than it. So it's yes, the sampling no, rate, the, the sampling rate for this signal, for this signal, I mean this first signal, at least must be 180 hertz. Okay, and we have 200 hertz. Okay, so so sampling rate, sampling rate of the system, sampling rate is greater than the Nyquist. Okay, is greater than the Nyquist. So it's okay. It's accepted. Now, let's go to the second cosine signal. The second cosine signal, it's, it's Nyquist will be what? Will be 220 hertz. And we are going to sample this signal by 200 hertz. So in this time, sampling rate for this signal, sampling rate will be less than Nyquist rate. So, uh, such a signal will deal will leads to what will leads to overlapping okay will leads to overlapping now <coughs> regarding to the first signal regarding to the first signal the signal will be reconstructed correctly we don't have any problem i mean when we are going to use the this is the f axis okay and we are going to use a low pass filter of course the low pass filter cutoff frequency fc fc for the low pass filter will be what will be 200 divided by 2 so this will be the cutoff frequency 100 and minus 100 okay this will be uh, the uh, transfer function of the low pass filter well so first of all when we are going to reconstruct the original signal for the first signal it will be reconstructed easily well so uh, this will be say the component of the first signal at 90 and minus 90. now what about the say the, the the second signal look please for the second signal now we have f l lazing look please f l lazing equals to what f not a plus k f s let us calculate f l lazing for the second signal now f a 
f a will be f not f not is equal to what equal to uh, 110 okay plus k f s is equal to 200 the sampling rate of the system well now let us try values for k different values for k we are going to try it now k at the beginning equals to let us make a simple table really make a simple table now this is k and this will be fa now when k equal to zero what will be the answer fa 110 okay but 110 lies outside the what the box of the low pass filter so uh, we don't care about it now now try k equal to one if k equal to one at that time 110 plus 200 eh depta chand 310 yeah 310 okay also again the this value of frequency will what will lies outside the box of the low pass filter so again we don't care about uh, this value now let us try to to try minus 1 okay minus 1 it will be Add in the chant minus hundred ten and it's also outside. Dim the chant minus hundred ten. Nahir. Very good. Minus not side. After a minus not. Aha. Now the question is Is there negative frequency? No. No, of course, we don't have negative frequencies. So what will be this minus sign? <laughs> we fall in a trap, huh? Eh? What does it mean, this minus sign? You have to help me. Said Alve Mana, no, it's going to be best John Bay, Solubor Moje. I need our Mojo, but best John Bay, Solubu, Mother Cavet. How is there you Mojo, which I like our Jida holiday, a lazing it? Yeah, I never said that. I can't get it. Tala had never lazing Nuka. Nuka may minus note, not frequency. Why on? Okay. I've solved a city. Yani... Yani... No, but I have a phase, a phase. Zani, Yanuka Methalan, Mahay Methalan cosine of minus theta. So, and cosine of minus theta equal to cosine of theta. Chingu is cosine signal chitishta, even function. No, by the way. Eh? طبعا خم ناخذ مثلا حط اقل مثلا مهبو مثلا ساين ويف مثلا مثلا تتزاني مثلا اقل مهبو ساين اوف ماينس ثيتا ايكوالز تو وات ايكوالز تو ماينس ساين اوف ثيتا اوكي يعني بس هي تاثيرها اللي يصير تشتي تاثيرها بس لسير فيزي براستي شنو ماينس لقداني فانكشن اكيد يعني معناها ايش تشتا صدو حشتي درجه يا ويدي فيس شيفت اوكي سو ماينس 90 مينز ناثينج اوكي دونت كير اباوت ات جاست ات مينز وات ات مينز uh, we have a uh, change in the phase, but look, it is 90 dig 90 frequency, so it will lies where where it will lies under the low pass filter. Uh -huh, inside the box of the low pass filter. So, what's going on by now, due to this, due to this sampling rate, okay, due to this sampling rate, the 90 hertz and 110 hertz looks what. Looks the same, isn't it or not? Hmm? How is it? Uh, are, are you with me or not? The next. Huh? Look, we said that when we are going to sample the two signals, okay? Cosine 2 pi 90 t with sampling rate equal to 200 at that time, easily we can reconstruct the original signal. Okay, why? 
because for the 90 uh, hertz, the sampling rate is greater than the Nyquist rate. So the signal can be reconstructed directly, successfully reconstructed. Now, do you hear me by now? Uh, uh, 90 degree, 90 degree can be reconstructed easily. Why? The sampling rate is greater than the Nyquist rate for this signal. While for the second signal, 110, the, the sampling is less than the Nyquist rate. So the signal cannot be reconstructed easily, okay? Or successfully. Now we are going to calculate the aliased components. Of course, which kind of aliased components are important for us? The aliased components which lies where? Inside the low pass filter bandwidth, okay? Outside the, 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 the low pass filter bandwidth will be, will be don't care for us, okay? We are going to what? We are going to just to pick up the signals which lies where? Inside the uh, box of the low pass filter or which will pass through the low pass filter. So, uh, 110, after applying this formula, uh, it will be nine, minus 90. So uh, what we can conclude, we can conclude that the 90, 90 hertz and 110 hertz, if they are sampled by 200 hertz, it will be what will be, will generate the same sample. This is the problem, okay? By now, uh, using, uh, sorry, by now using uh, this sampling grade will lead to generate what, what the both signals will generate the same samples, and this is called ambiguity or a lazing in the uh, digital signal processing. Now I'm going to uh, uh, read your uh, names. So please open up your mics to hear your uh, voice, uh, to be able to hear your voice. Okay, uh, well, uh, Aching, Ibrahim. Alan Yunus, Alan, Alan, Mishkleir, Mikey, no Mishkleir, Aya Ayad, Aya, Avahi, Avahi, Nur, Nurva. Nurva. Acham Sheikh Musa. Acham Sheikh Musa. Bel Seda. Asma Fakhar. Asma Fakhar. Asma. Bel. Asya Ahmed. Abdul Samir. Bale Sayda. Alias Ibrahim. Bale Sayda. Iman Ismail. Iman. Bale Sayda. Iman Salam. Iman Salam. Iman Salam. Avin Hsien, Avin Hsien, Bias Nadam, Balisina, Balisina, Banan Muhammad Mustafa, Balisida, Bayav Namatallah, Bayav Namatallah, Thamar Akram, Balisida, Thamar Akram, Balisida, Juan Juma, Balisida. Jihad Nadam. Bali Sayda. Khadija Hanim. Bali Sayda. Khawla Maghdad. Daoud Suleiman Yasin. Daoud. 
بالا سيدا اه تواجدي ايه دلزان محمد عبد الرحمن بالا سيدا دلشاد محمد مهدي دلشاد محمد مهدي اوكي دلفين حسين علي دلفين دلفين حسين دلين صمد احمد دلين دنيا فخر الدين عزيز ديانا نادر نعم بل سيدة درستا دلما صباح بل سيدة رابر عز الدين بل سيدة روجان صالح روجان بل سيدة ريجين رمزي بل سيدة اوكي ريوان نادر ريوان نادر بل سيدة زان سليمان بل دكتور دس خوش زانا باقي دي يعني أبا عجيبة إنه تبلي في إيري جيبيني خوش ترازي بتن شاء الله زيد أحمد زيد موجودة بل بل سيدة زينب لقمان زينب زينب لقمان زينة سمير زينة سمير اوكي جيان عبد الرحمن بالي سيدة جيمان مجيد بالي سيدة سامان حسين بالي سيدة سدرة, سدرة يوسف بالي سيدة سهمي محمد يوسف بالي سيدة سينار صدقي بالا سيدة شارين حسين بالا سيدة شمال حميد شمال بالا سيدة شنيان مصطفى هيرو بالا سيدة صباح حسن محمود بالا سيدة صديق ياسين صديق بالا دكتور علي أكرم بالا دكتور فيان جعفر بالا سيدة فيم بنجين بالا سيدة فرهنج خوشناو فرهنج فرهنج كمال ريان كامل كمال ريان كافي سلمان بالي سيد لافا عبد الستار لافا محمد احمد بالي سيد محمد جمال محمد جمال محمد حسين بلى سيدة محمد زيدان جرجيس بلى محمد صالح فخري بلى سيدة بلى محمد نزار إبراهيم بلى دكتور عزيزي مسعود رمضان بلى دكتور مصطفى جمال بشير مصطفى برا مصطفى دكتور بلى عزيزي سيدة محمد جمال من بس ما يكمل لو شو نفسه. سيدا. بلي. سيدا العفو. سيدا مجينا رخصة ترى في متقول متقولي بلي بس نزونا. تأكيد أنا بتشيء. إيمان سلام على دسفيك. كيف؟ إيمان سلام سيدا على دسفيك. إيمان سلام موجودة إيمان سلام. إيمان سلام بس. إيمان سلام درست موجودة بلي. أوكي. مصطفى جمال. مصطفى جمال هنا ميديا عبد الغفار ميديا بلى بلى سيدة ميديا قاسم ميديا قاسم ميديا قاسم <تصفيق> نادل الفين انت موجود الدلفين الدلفين سيدة أو دلفين أو دلفين أو ميكور سيدة دلفين بلي موجودة دلفين دلفين حسين سيدة نوفي ما تشكرد ما تشكرد ما تشكرد درستة نوكا بس ما هاي مير أبو بكر مير موجودة مير أبو بكر بلي بلي ونبز قاسم قانا بز بلي بلي دكتور أفهم داوي نينر در چه ولی تو روش؟ عزیزم خوشت رازی بیت. نه نه عثمان نه عثمان عزیز تو. نه نه. بله. موجودی نه است. نواف حجیلیاس. 
نواف ايش هي موجوده اصلا نور حسن نور حسن بالي سيدة بالي نورا صالح بالي سيدة نيروش بالي سيدة هابيل بالي دكتور هشام رمضان بالي دكتور اوكي هلبين علي هلبين هنر فرهاد هنر فرهاد حاضر لا موجود درسته هنر فرهاد هيلين حسيب هيلين هيلين حسيب هيلين عامر بالي وفاء صالح بالي يسرى ابراهيم بالي يعقوب ابراهيم يعقوب بالي دكتور بالي دكتور عزيزم. يوسف يوسف مطلب يوسف مطلب بلى سيدة يونس نصرت بلى دكتور عزيزة اوكي ده دقاء ويدي دكتور بلى برا دكتور بس اولان يونس اس حتى ورا كاسي ما تشوبو ما خارم خوفك دينا اشنا بين بولي بولي بلى من خان اولان يونس ايه اس تشوبو ما خاري دكتور حتى صوت ما ساري تشنا بين بولي انا لا لا على نفس موجودة درستة كيف تسمي جماعة بالي؟ أوكي عزيز مسر شاوا سر شاوا أوكي نكرهش تا شارك كي وصل ندرس لك إن شاء الله أوكي خاطره